Alright guys, it's Gameboy Luke here, and welcome back to some more Pokemon Emerald Extreme Randomizer Nuzlocke. In the previous episode, we uh, we pretty much activated a bunch of story stuff. We didn't do a great deal. Uh, we activated the Team Magma Aqua event so we could go to Mount, Mount Chimney and deal with all this right now. Um, and pretty much, we were just trying to get Pichu to evolve, and he wasn't cooperating basically. We were trying our damn hardest to get Tobo to evolve here. Um, and the only way we can do it really is by just running around, leveling him up in our party, and hoping that he evolves soon, I guess. Um, We've never faced against, uh, faced off against uh, any of these guys, any of the Mag Magma Aqua members just yet. Um, wait, have we? We faced off against two actually. We faced off against two Aqua guys, I think it was. Um, and faced off against Aqua. We don't even know. We haven't faced any, any Magma people yet. That's that's what that's what it is. Oh my goodness, Krabby is baby Gookie. This is Cookie. This is Cookie, and this is Gookie. Just you don't have to understand. It's just how it's just it's just how it is. All right, just so you know. What is what is Krabby even? It's water type. Oh, that's such an ass, dude. I have I only have steel and water type. Steel and um, this isn't gonna do anything, is it? I have steel and ice type moves. It's water type. It kept its water type. That's so lame. Or is it water ice now? No, it can't be water ice because I just used a steel type move and it was new. <sighs> Bro, I hate it when they miss. I hate it when it misses. Literally, like a 90, is it 95? I'm pretty sure it's like a 95 accuracy move, and it misses so consistently. Jesus. Okay. Get out of my face, Krabby. Get that experience to Tobo. We could have killed... Oh no, Tobo's a nice type. We could not have killed that, that Krabby. I was thinking he's an electric type for some reason. That's ridiculous. I think, I don't know if you get happiness for winning battles too. I think you should. I think Bulbapedia is lying to me to an extent. I did my best to raise it as high as I could, but... I mean, just running around, just just, just running around on a, on a bike and getting its happiness up. I'm hoping it was enough, but we'll see. We shall see. I should not switch into for alligator like this, because one a freaking move, sing. Okay, hit him on top. I just hope you're not randomized to the same type you were before. Wakey, wakey, rise and shine. Amnesia. That's kind of scary. For a Hitmontop to have? That's really scary. He's got really good special defense. Come here. Bam. Easy. Whoa! Hold the phone. He's lived. I was about to gloat way big about how we just destroyed this thing, but never mind. Hold up. Come here. Bring that ass here. I think killing him Hitmontop's going to give us like 500 experience, though, because he's like a fully evolved Pokemon. Or not. Cool. Just straight up call me a liar. Damn. Never mind. Never mind. Huh? What do you mean I lost? You lost. You lost, buddy. You lost. So you've come all the way here, but you're too late. I've already just delivered a meteorite to the meteor uh, from Meteor Falls to the boss. All right, come here. I'm about to dick you down. Who's this man? Tabitha? All right, dude. Foratress? What in God's name is Foratress? He's not a very strong Pokemon. In terms of like offensive headbutt, oh hello, let's go. Are you just a normal type, buddy? Okay, it's neutral. I should kill there. Oh, egg bomb! Happy Easter. Oh Jesus! Actually, I did more than I wanted it to. Is it got you? Yo, I didn't even think for a second that Pokemon could get huge power. Can you imagine if that Foraders like had like huge power or something? That would be wild. That would be wild. If I remember correctly from facing the tentacle in the grass before, I think they're a weird hybrid type. Um, it has it had jump kick, but I don't think it was fighting type. I used sludge uh, poison moves on it and it was re resisted. Yeah, that's the jump kicks. That's why I expected because I resist. I'm gonna resist that. I think sludge is gonna do damage, but I also believe that he resists it. Yeah, he does. I don't remember what type he is. He might be poison fighting, maybe? I actually have no idea. I actually have no idea. And when does, like, Blaziken learn a new move? Kind of curious. In Gen 3, when does Blaziken learn a new move? He's pretty close. In Generation 3, gener Generation 3. We're 25, he learns a new move at 28. Uh, I didn't see what Pokemon that was, actually. He learns a new move at 28. 
What is it? What is it? It's a uh, Tauros. Oh my god. Okay. Wow, we all know. Yo, can you imagine if they got Tauros with huge power? And it was like a fighting ghost type or some shit? D There's the superpower. Oh god, it's fighting. Okay. Alright, that's fine. I can just earthquake you. These fighting types are all over the place. Tauros as a fighting type is actually crazy. Actually crazy. That's so strong. Ooh, that experience! Yum! Yummy! Pikachu? Oh my god, it's your big brother, buddy! Look at it! It's your big bro! Pikachu! Alright, hold up. Yeah, we have a Thunderstone. Can we get a Pikachu? Yo, does someone want to just deliver me a Pikachu right now, please? I have the Thunderstone for it and everything. It's what- if Pikachu evolves into Pikachu, I'm not gonna be mad. Acid armor is poison! <laughs> What in- What in tarnation? What an evolution! It doesn't work if there's- It has to have an A behind the N. Like, ocean. It has to have nation in it. Oh, no, it has to be like, What in revelation? It has to be Asian. Alright, cool. We got mad stacks of cash off that. Alright. Tobo. What are we looking at right now, bro? You're 490 away? So we just need to level you up. I th I'm hoping, dude. Whatever. I, I, I get my hopes up at this point, and it's just like, you know, I don't even know if it's gonna be a thing. Don't really care. Pulse effect wore off. The power contained with this meteorite. By amplifying its power with this machine, Mount Chimney's volcanic activity will instantly intensify. Its energy will grow deep inside the crater, and... <laughs> Who are you? I heard Archie bemoaning a child who's been meddling in Team Aqua's affairs. It must be you he meant. Ha! Huh. So you think you're in, uh, you, so you're thinking of interfering with us, Team Magma? Now you listened long ago. Living things used to let use the land to live and grow. That is why land is all important. It's the cradle of all. That's why Team Magma is dedicated to the expansion of land mass. It is for further advancement of humankind and Pokemon. And for that, we need the power of what sleeps within this mountain. Oh, I was no need for you to learn that much. But no matter, I'll teach you the consequences of meddling in our grand design. Let's get it. Let's get it. Mantine? What the hell? Wait, we faced Mantine. I don't remember what type it was. I don't remember. It picked on B. Oh fuck, it just killed me. That's definitely just killed me. Oh f Bro, I can't believe we just survived that. Oh, he's just gonna keep using it. All right. Um. Okay. Who can take a water spot? Who's got a good spadef here? You've got 81 HP. All right. We need to. Uh, I can't go near. I have to go near you. I have to sludge you. Oh, I shouldn't have done the switch training. I shouldn't have. This has put me in a big bad situation. Water spot only has five PP though. I'm hoping this won't do a great deal. Okay, uh, if I get myself the full HP, I think I can take a couple of these. Oh, signal beam, I, I resisted. Yum, okay, easy. Don't confuse me, though. Okay, okay, okay. We can sludge this thing and be fine, I think, because Water Spout will do, weak, will do less damage now. Even if he crits me, Water Spout will do less damage. Okay, we're safe. Dude, these water types are a pain. How much experience did Pichu get? That's not enough. That's not enough to level him up. Charizard? Okay, we can't play. We can't play around with that. Let's just go to... Bro, I have no idea what Charizard is. Suitable for Team Magma though, right? Oh, it's resisted shit. I did a lot of damage though. Give me attack raise. It's still fire type. It's still a fire type. <sighs> These ice types, I can't deal with it. Of course Charizard's type wouldn't change. Why wouldn't it change, right? Present. It's so unfortunate. It's so unfortunate. Ice steel types are just not good. They're just not. 
Oh, we know this is a water type, bro. Uh... I kind of want to switch train real quick. This is water type. I just got a fusion. I'm gonna start. I can't. I can't. I can't risk it. There's no way. Primate is pure water type. He's not got any special attack. We should be good. He's setting up a razor wind. Okay. This is gonna do enough. I don't think a razor wind will kill me. I'm not really scared of razor wind actually. Oh my goodness. I should have been. Jesus Christ, primate. All right, we lost off for alligators. There's nothing we can do about it. Ice Steel type, which is so much pressure on my shoulders, dude. There's no way we could have got around that. What? I was Max was caught off guard. Yes, you were. Fuck you. <sighs> Didn't want to lose him. But at the same time, seeing him die really doesn't surprise me. It just doesn't because he is so frail. Fighting types are quite effective. Fire types quite effective. Ground is super effective. So many types are super effective against him, and it was just not helping his case. And I. I was kind of, I kind of knew that eventually he was probably gonna die. Like, that much was obvious. He's so, so easily one-hittable. There's nothing we could have done about it. There's nothing we could have done about it. It's a shame. Um, hi Luke, this is Isaac. Don't talk to me, my Pokemon just died. My Pokemon literally just died. Do not talk to me, bro. Not in the best mood. NGL. Right, it sells me a lava cake. I don't want a lava cookie. I, I don't even care. Yo, battle me, bro. Get my get my Pichu to to level up. We get we we should get an encounter here as well. This is Jagged Pass, separate area. So, Absol. What type is Absol? What type is Absol? I'm not messing around. I'm literally gonna bring bring Kingler in to deal with everybody. Ooh, that would have hurt. That would have hurt. It wouldn't be super effective, but it would have hurt. Alright. Hi. So we're level 28. Now we just play the waiting game. Rhyhorn. I'd have no idea what type you are, but I'm gonna earthquake you. Literally just gonna boop. As resisted, that's crazy. That's crazy. Bug type with Mega Horn. That's kind of that's kind of cool. Loki want a Rhyhorn. That's kind of cool. He has Mega Horn. What a what a man, dude. What a man. Hiker Eric, losing left me bitter. It better have. Oh, finally, Pichu. What do we have? What are we dealing with? Pichu evolves into a. Paris. We we get a, a Paris. Alright, does Paris learn any moves soon? No, he doesn't. You got a Paris. A level 28 Paris. Water grass with shell armor. Uh, he'd learn a new move at 31. His next learn, learn move will be 31. He's 28, so I could rock out with him, but if I just wreck does he, when's he evolve? 24, so I can just rare candy this guy right now. He can evolve again. Golduck! Yeah, I'll take Golduck! Hell yeah! He finally evolved, and it's into a Golduck. I'm not- I'm not mad. This man learns a new move at 31. Hold the phone. What type are you, buddy? Please don't be quad effective to everything. Grass Dragon! Quad effective to ice! God damn it. But we are- we're Grass Dragon. Uh, we resist a lot of stuff. We're weak to bug, poison, dragon, ice, flying, fire- no, nope, not fire. We have a lot of weaknesses, uh, actually, but I mean, we can make do. It's not a big deal, I guess. Let's just go ahead and get our encounter for this route. It was a freaking gold duck, dude. Okay. First encounter here is a Teddy Ursa. All right, when does Teddy Ursa evolve? Teddy Ursa. Teddy Ursa! 
He evolves at level 30. So we have another Pokemon that potentially evolves fairly soon. Uh, we should Poison Sting it. Nice, it's resisted. Perfect. Poison it. So, is it is a grass type? But that poison thing was resisted, so it can't be. Unless it's a poison type itself, that's why I can't. That's why I can't poison it right now. Yeah, it's not doing anything. Let's just let's just speed up the poison in then. Oh no, we can poison it. Oh shit. Okay, hold up. I need to remember. Okay, Jesus Christ! I need to great ball this thing now. I need to remember too that um, it's poison, so I need to I need to petra berry it instantly. Got him. Hell yeah. All right, let's get another comment for you dudes. I'm only named after Pokemon, so I can die two seconds after being caught. All right, Johnny, you got it. Teddy Ursa. You, you, you're, you're a female, but you're gonna be called Johnny. Hell yeah. All right, let's remember to Petra Berry or Antidote or whatever we need to do right now. Petra Berry, use. Bam, cured of his poisoning. Perfect. He is a, or she is, a rock electric type with forecast. Uh, spark, solar beam, thunder, uproar. Okay, okay. Uh, I think we can make Johnny work and I think we can definitely level him up. I can definitely grind him in between episodes if necessary. Um, I can't do anything with you right now, can I? What, what are you doing here? What am I doing in a place like this? Is this business, business of yours? Oh shit, I didn't think he fought me right now actually. I didn't expect for that to happen, actually. That's an ugly buff. Oh my god. Hey. Look at Johnny. Oh, BB. He says, wait, electric rock and he learned. Wait, electric rock and he learned. He learned solar beam. That makes no sense to me. Nice shape. What the? What the? Ow, ow, ow. Okay, hold up. Let's uh, shoot your roar beam. So we actually have special attack now, and this Skullduck's actually going to be able to put in work. Hell yeah. Whoa. Oh, we eat that. What the hell? Oh, it's ghost type. Why'd I just do that? I Why'd I do that? That's stupid. We should see if this guy can learn any TMs, though. I know Golduck. Wait, Golduck? We have, them, we have them still up, right? In terms of his stats, dude. He's all really good. He's well, not really good, but he's got better. Oh my god, Pidgeot! Hello. Please tell me you're still like grass or something. Ah, uh, it's resisted. That's not good. Water gun. That's quad resisted, bro. So my facade, you then instead. Oh yeah, boy. That's right. Keep water. Is it this Pidgeot is the water god? Come here. Oh, that's also, wait, when we reach, what's the town's name? Falaba? No, not Falaba, it's Laverage Town. There's an egg that we can hatch. That's kind of interesting, because that's going to be randomized as well, I think. And if it's not, it's going to be a why not, which we can evolve. I'm going to skip out these trainers, because I can grind in between episodes, like, turn around, bro. All right, that's fine. That's all I wanted to do real quick. There's an item over there. I need to get that at some point. I need to heal. I want this egg. That's what I'm trying to do right now. We could hatch that egg, like, right now. Let me heal up. We're definitely going to use Johnny. He is, a, he is definitely on the team. Uh, we just need to grind in between episodes. I might get the whole team up to level 30 or something. It's about right. right. All right. Hey, you. Hey, if you're an egg, uh, I hope to hatch you by covering up the hot sand. It seems to be enough. I'd be best to keep it the train if everyone's carried about. You're a trainer, yes? Hell yeah. You have too many Pokemon? Shit! Hold up. Give me one second, bro. I would absolutely love to take this egg off your hands because it might hatch into something fabulous. Alright, let's do this. Boop, and put Terry in here. Hopefully, Teddy Ursa evolves into something ridiculous. Alright, yeah, we already. Where'd you, where'd you speak? Where'd you speak? Give me the egg. Alright, sweet deal. We have an egg. Uh, let's see if it's a legendary Pokemon. They take a ridiculous long time. Ridiculously long time. It says it will take some time. Okay. Okay. Well, I have no idea of testing how long it's going to take to hatch the egg. I guess we could. I could pause the video here. Actually, you no. Know I'm going to do that. I'm going to pause the video right here, and I will be back in a moment where I will have uh, got the egg hatched. So give me a second.
All right, finally, egg is hatching. Been here for a while. The egg is a. It's Voltorb. Uh, that's kind of cool because Voltorb uh, evolves fairly early, I believe. Voltorb. Need to give a nickname to this bad boy. So let's go back to the video, and we're gonna name this thing. I'm gonna name this thing. Uh. You should name a Pokemon Banjo just because you have the kazoo. Alright, we're calling him Banjo. What is this man? Banjo level 5 is a fighting type with Volt Absorb. Uh, Mento Volt Throw Tail Glow, that's a good thing to have. And if we level it evol up, it evolves at 32. At level 30 as well as... Uh, Johnny over here. So if I get these both for like level 29 and then the next episode I evolve them both on screen. How would that be? That'd be kind of cool. We have a fucking full team right here guys. This is sick. So Next episode gonna get everyone to level 30. Every single member of the team will be level 30. I'll do a grinding montage and everything But uh, that's kind of cool. We got a Volto from the egg. I will take that. That's that's fabulous um, Very pleased Very pleased We can probably do some pretty cool stuff with them. I'm hoping I will see what he evolves into obviously, but uh yeah, I'm gonna end this episode off right here. It's been about 20 minutes. Uh, if you guys have enjoyed, you know, we did a whole bunch of stuff. We got a whole bunch of new Pokemon and stuff. Please leave a like rating down below. If you wanna see the series coming daily? Uh, I really appreciate it. Thank you all so much for your support. And I'll see you guys next time where we're evolving Johnny and Banjo and uh, seeing what we can do uh, against Flannery as well. So uh, thank you so much for watching again. I'll see you guys next time.